Charleston woman wanted for murder may still be in this area. 35-year-old Caitlin Marie Armstrong is accused of killing 25-year-old Anna Mariah Wilson, a well-known athlete in the cyclist world. Wilson was found shot inside a home in East Austin nearly two weeks ago. The U.S. Marshal's Office says the biggest clue they're looking for right now is her car. It's a black Jeep Cherokee. Federal agents are relying on us to generate more tips on Armstrong. KXAN's Tara Rahman spoke today with the deputy marshal in Austin for the latest on their investigation. The U.S. Marshal's Office says Caitlin Armstrong has had time to plan. So from the time that we were requested for assistance, I mean, you're looking at probably five days have lapsed. Um, she was brought in for questioning. Um, and at some point, you know, she may have absconded, whether her conscience got a hold of her or she knew that these uh, investigators with the Austin Police Police Department would eventually get a warrant. You know, that's unknown. Police say Armstrong was dating another pro cyclist in Austin, and officers believe she thought her boyfriend still allegedly had a relationship with Mo Wilson and killed her while Wilson was visiting. Deputy Marshal Brandon Fila says it's likely Armstrong looks different. Uh, change your hair color, maybe change her hairstyle, maybe cut it shorter. You always see that when you have some type of, you know, violent case like this um, where they had time, right? Fila says they've only received about a handful of tips on this case so far, but one of them came in this weekend. They say they're reviewing video footage from a neighbor here that shows Armstrong apparently the day after she was interviewed by Austin police. And you can see there that uh, she, you know, she has an urgency. Uh, it's an emergency to her. Um, and, you know, she's trying to use someone's telephone to call someone else. They do believe the realtor and yoga teacher is likely still in the Austin area. There are a lot of what ifs. Uh, and we figured right now with her involvement here in the Austin community uh, that she would still likely be here. Tahira Rahman, KXAN News. The U.S. Marshal's Office says they've got between three and ten agents on this case on any given day, but that could expand if they get a tip that Armstrong has crossed state or country lines. They also want to remind everyone that if anyone provides Armstrong any relief while she's a fugitive, they could also be charged with a federal crime. If you've got a tip in this investigation, we've got the U.S. Marshal's Office contact information for you at KXAN.com. The U.S. Marshals have another active manhunt in Texas. They are looking for escapee Gonzalo Lopez, who's been on the run since he was able to free himself from his handcuffs while he and 15 others were on a prison bus. Detectives say he also attacked the bus driver. The bus was headed to Huntsville after leaving Gatesville. Lopez was convicted for capital murder.